bring it into the mill and it's inspected to check the quality. It's then placed into the unloading pit. The bags are opened and the rice falls out. Next, it's transported to large structures outside the grain store, which are called silos. After the rice is placed in the silos, the first job is to clean the rice following its long journey. A magnet and a sieve are used to do this. First, any bits of metal are removed by the magnet, and then the biggest pieces of grit are taken out using a sieve. This machine is the de-stoner. Its job is to remove all the smaller bits of stone left in among the rice grain. Now the rice is ready for milling. The machine looks like this. The grains of rice are milled using large stones, which rub the rice to take off the outer layers. The more the rice is milled, the whiter the rice becomes. So brown rice, like this, is only milled once. But white rice, like this, is milled three times. They have to be very careful when they are doing this, as they don't want to break the tiny grains. This machine is next in the process. It uses water and a rubbing motion to make sure each grain of rice is polished and shiny. Next, the colour of the rice is checked by this machine, using an electronic eye. It looks at every grain and the discoloured ones are rejected. Nothing goes to waste, as anything the machines reject is used for animal feed. Once the rice is processed, it's then packaged. This clever machine weighs the right amount and then bags it up. Finally, they are put into boxes, and each one is put into a pallet with 120 other boxes. The pallets are covered in protective plastic.